guys, it's Rachel, and I've been noticing some crazy haircuts during this year's World Cup, so I wanna take a look at what these guys are rocking on their head. Ch -ch -ch chia he looks like a Chia pet. I don't think it's that bad. We we'll maybe brush the top, because it looks like there's a little nest going on up there. Is that a B? What is, oh, three. He's number three, I'm hoping. Or he has like three kids or something. What country is this? Vidal Sassoon is a hair brand. Maybe that's what he's named after. Do we have a weave? Can I see, is it a ponytail? Are those stuck to his head or can they fly? I'm not a fan. He looks like Corbin Blue. You know, remember Corbin Blue from uh, High School Musical? It looks like all the hair that he shaved off from the side of his head, he just stuck it on his beard. It looks like Tyler from Dude Perfect. Not the mohawk, but the beard. Actually, he may be doing a lot of headers because he has a lot of hair up there, so it's like extra padding, but he can't do like side headers because that would hurt more because, you know, it's shaved. You know what? It's actually becoming not cool to have a mohawk because it seems like everybody in soccer has a mohawk. Be original, guys. There's David Beckham, right? Oh, no. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure that you comment below and let me know who you thought has the craziest hairstyle. Thumbs up this video, subscribe to The Whistle for more swag list, and I'll see you next time. Okay, guys, so I've come to three conclusions about soccer hairstyles. One, wear a mohawk. Two, it's perfectly okay to put your number in the side of your head. And three, you better look sweaty all the time.